Assalamu alaikum and good morning my dear all friends. I'm Ahmad Rashid Ahmad Zay again with a new English lecture. We start with a name for my children. Most gracious and most merciful. My dear all friends, before starting our today's lecture, I want to ask you all to like my videos, subscribe my YouTube channel, and also it is mentionable that I want to all my viewers to write your comments in the com my video comment section. And also my dear all friends, to receive the new notification of uh, my new videos also try to press the bell icon okay my dear all friends so let's start our today's lecture today the lecture is about who is and also who's it is completely simple to discover the difference between who is and also who's but they are really similar really um, uh, similar in writing it means while we are writing who's and also who's we need to be very careful okay my dear all friends as you all can see they both are double question why can we call them uh, double question because the good uh, consists a W and H. And the next thing, my dear old friends, we use who to talk about person or to ask about person or about the um, group of persons. And also, we use who to receive or get um, uh, uh, information about someone, position or ownership. For example, who who is studying English? Something that I already write down in here, my dear old friends. Who is uh, has um, two full form? It means this is the contract form of two other forms. We consider the full form of who is as uh, who would are to be full and also who would are to have verb or who would and has. Okay, where can we use them? We can use who is and present tense. We can use who has and present perfect tense. Also, we can say that we can use it in perfect tenses. Also, when we're using has as the main verb in our sentence, we also can use as uh, um, and pre simple present tense as well. Okay, my dear all friends, let's have some examples. For example, who is studying English? Who's, uh, uh, who is finished? Is our air homework. And an example for whose, whose pen is this? My dear all friends, and um, and using whose I want to mention a note if you want to use whose properly always try to use whose plus a noun for example whose marker is this this is Russia's marker and an answer that you are going to give for whose always try to use an apostrophe s after the name of the owner okay my dear old friends it was our previous lecture about whose versus whose uh, I hope you enjoyed and learned some new things for our previous lecture do not forget to uh, like my videos, subscribe my YouTube channel, and press the bell icon of my YouTube channel to receive all the notifications of my new videos. And my dear old friend is really mentionable that I want your comments as well in my video comment section. Take care of yourself. Be blessed. Allah Hafiz.